this is the uh, latest uh, version of our carbon regeneration kilns. It's come from listening to our clients over the 30 years, understanding how we can do better. It was all about negotiating with them what they wanted for the project and what we could deliver. It comes now with a number of enhanced features and we have a new enhanced, what we call pipe screen. This is a screen that allows the carbon before it goes into the kiln to drain that excess water. In the past it's been difficult to remove the screen itself for maintenance purposes and to clean. We've modified the pipe screen to allow removal of the screen basket itself easily. Just undo four little knobs and pull the door off and pull the screen out and replace it, whereas in the past you'd have to take out the whole section. It's about a six hour job as opposed to this probably five, ten minutes. The second feature is our new watertight valve. You don't want water leaking out of the slide gate um, on top of the uh, pre-dryer or onto the kiln itself. And so we've installed a slide gate now which um, is completely watertight um, and it works much better than the slide gates that we've used in the past. The third feature is our weatherproofing. The locations that these kilns are in are under a lot of stress due to weather and rain. Some sites have corrosive materials and that, so it won't be landing on the burners, it'll land on the cover. The fourth point is our steam pipe. Uh, some of our clients have had issues with blockages, so we've put a cover on each end and we have basically like an old chimney sweep type arrangement and you just poke that through the hole and it cleans out the soot that builds up and stops the blockage. No longer does it need uh, shutdown or high level intervention from, from maintenance people. There are times when the carbon at site may get blocked downstream for reasons totally unassociated with the carbon regen kill. Therefore, we've developed a short bypass route so that if carbon does come back up, it can escape out of the kiln without damaging any of the internals. Now, we've built over now 350 of these machines over the last 30 years, and our clients have highlighted opportunities for us to improve it. We're a tight-knit group down here, so the communication is quite free-flowing, so when we hear feedback from site, when we hear feedback from the EPC, it goes directly to the engineers and the changes happen quite quickly. And we're proud to say now that we've encompassed those uh, improvements and we have a very contemporary carbon regen kiln to offer around the world. Mm -hmm.